launching your MindBody branded mobile app is a collaborative process. You choose the images and colors your clients will see and work with us to design how the app will function. MindBody then gets to work, building your mobile app and getting it ready to launch. If you're an Android user, then your work is done for now. But if you are an iOS user, then there's a few additional steps Apple requires. Please note that you will need to complete these steps before both your Android and Apple app versions can go live. In this video, we will briefly explain what you, MindBody, and Apple will need to do to get your iOS branded app launched. After purchasing branded app, the first thing you'll need to do is email MindBody your logos, background images, and color schemes that you wish to incorporate in your design for the app. If there is a specific design direction or color scheme you would like us to incorporate, please include this information in the body of your email. Once we have received all of your app images, our team will design a mock-up of your brand and mobile app. While our launch team builds this mock-up, we ask that you log into your app dashboard and submit your app details, such as setting up managers, editing app settings, adding promotions, and sending push notifications. Before proceeding to the launch phase, we'll email you the mock-up we've designed according to your specifications. This is your opportunity to see how the app will look aesthetically and to provide suggestions for our team. When the app meets your satisfaction, you will approve the final design. Please note that any post-launch changes made to your app may incur a fee to cover the associated redesign and deployment costs. After receiving your design approval, our launch team will begin to build your app. Before your app can be submitted to the Apple and Google Play stores, you must enroll in the Apple Developer Program and invite MindBody to manage your app again. Because this step can take two to four weeks to complete in full, we recommend starting the process as soon as possible. What's needed in order to register as an Apple Developer? You will need to set up a custom business email with your own domain name, such as owner at yourcompany.com, in order to sign up for an Apple Developer account. Apple won't accept personal email addresses for the branded mobile app. Your business must register as a corporation, LLC, or other legal entity. Apple won't permit sole proprietorships to launch apps through this program, and they do not permit the use of DBAs, fictitious business names, trade names, or branch names. You will also need to submit your DUNS number. The Data Universal Numbering System number is a unique identifier used to verify your business's identity and legal status. Essentially, it shows Apple that your business is legitimate and should be permitted to publish on their platform. These numbers are automatically issued to eligible businesses for free by a company called Dun and Bradstreet. If you've registered as a legal entity in the past, then it's possible a DUNS number has already been assigned to you. When enrolling in the Apple Developer Program, we recommend creating an Apple ID specifically for your business. This ID should be separate from your personal Apple ID, as Apple will use the linked email address to communicate updates about your app and bill your annual $99 registration fee. Once you've completed all the prior steps mentioned, then you're ready to enroll your application to the Apple Developer Program. After submitting your application, Apple will contact you within two weeks to verify enrollment. You will then receive a confirmation email at your Apple ID email address with an enclosed link. This link will be used to confirm and pay for your developer membership. You'll have enrolled successfully in the Apple Developer Program once you see the Thank You screen. You'll receive a welcome email and a payment confirmation email from Apple soon after. Lastly, you'll need to invite MindBody to manage your accounts through both the Apple Developer website and the App Store Connect. This grants us permission to publish the branded mobile app on your behalf and publish any changes you want down the road. If you're an existing branded mobile app subscriber, that is, your app has already launched and been delivered to customers, then you'll need to complete an app transfer request. This is the final step that moves your app from MindBody's developer account to your newly created Apple account. 
It's important to understand that this policy is not implemented by MindBody. These steps are dictated by Apple and apply to every business that operates on the App Store. Our goal is to make this process as straightforward and painless as possible for you and your business. We understand how these additional steps can impact your plans, and our team is here to assist you throughout the process. Working together, we hope we can minimize the impact to your business and ultimately deliver a custom app that makes life easier for both you and the clients you serve.